different light. There are heavenly bodies and earthly bodies, but the glory of the heavenly is of one kind, and the glory of the earthly is of another. There is one glory of the sun, and another glory of the moon, and another glory of the stars, for star differs from star in glory. 1 Corinthians 15 verses 40 to 41. The glory of heaven that Apostle Paul talked about is like light. Just as the light of the sun, the light of the moon, and the light of the stars are different, the light that people living in heaven emit is different from the light emitted by those living on earth. The light that shines through the touch, expression, and actions of Christians is a light that pushes away gloom and darkness, but the light of those on earth leads together toward the path of death. We need to examine ourselves to see what glory we show to our families and neighbors in our daily lives. Jesus called himself the light of the world, and he lived a life of coexistence with God's glory. Because he did not compromise to show the glory of heaven on earth, did not succumb to threats, and did not stop walking on the path of the cross, people could gain wisdom of life that surpasses their limits within the light of that glory. And those who see this light of God's glory and live according to it are called those who belong to heaven. Today, Christians are people who show and live the glory of God who saved them, who resemble his character, bear his fruits, and live the life of those who belong to heaven. I hope we can spend such a day today. Loving Lord, I pray in the name of Jesus that our words, actions, and lives today can be a light that reveals the glory of those who belong to heaven, filling our shortcomings and guiding our weaknesses. Amen.